my name is Rich Hochran. Uh, I'm, an, I'm, a, and I'm a sector lead in our technology business development team at Morgan Stanley. Um, I cover areas related to application development, fintech, and data technologies. It's no secret that data has become one of the most critical assets driving growth within the financial services industry. Large-scale financial institutions, uh, organizations, I'm sorry, are always looking for better ways to leverage data to add more value to existing client relationships and to open up new customer segments. However, technical and compliance challenges make it difficult for many of these firms to be agile when it comes to testing, accessing, and ultimately integrating the data, this data. Additionally, the number of niche data providers is growing and the cost of, to access data is rising steadily. DMS Data has stepped up to solve these combined challenges. DMS Data's cloud-based platform allows customers to explore and integrate new data sources more rapidly while continuing to get better insights onto the data usage within a firm. Through the partnership that Mark and the DMS Data team has forged with the mentors in the FinTech Innovation Lab, the company has refined their offering and has shown flexibility in meeting the needs of enterprise customers. Please, please help me introduce Mark Hookie, CEO of DMS Data. Thank you, Richard. Let's talk about the exciting topic of data compliance. It is actually an exciting time. There is a proliferation of siloed data that's increasingly available about customers. That's the supply side of the data market. On the demand side, financial institutions are looking for better ways to serve new segments of customers. Digitally, we've heard about some of the compliance and fraud use cases, people looking to originate loans. But there's a disconnect. Data access and compliance is hard, and it's increasingly challenging to stay compliant with how data is pulled into financial institutions. DMIST provides a data access and compliance service. Financial institutions are looking to us to improve the efficiency with which they pull in information into their business. We are the data janitors. We help with information security, we help with cleaning and structuring data, and we do that through our two flagship products, Labs and Gateway. Labs helps clients discover what data matters. Through one partnership with us, we've built out hundreds and hundreds of contracts with niche data partners, and we allow clients to compliantly test what matters and what doesn't with respect to a workflow about their customer. So if they're looking to originate a customer online, how do they know which ones are good customers? How do they know what product needs to be shown to the customer? We can do that and rank order what data matters in a fraction of the time of current processes. Some institutions, for various reasons, take a year plus to test and ingest one new data partner. With us, we've been able to work with big institutions and test 30, 40, 50 data sources in a matter of a month or two because we're able to create a safe sandbox for that data test testing. Excuse me. That increases the reach of data and that means good things for the customers. It means customers like us Australians who might be new to the country uh, or thin file customers are able to get products that they otherwise wouldn't be able to get. And Gateway allows for a 360 degree view of how data is monitored through the system. Data goes across border, data needs to be protected, there's various controls around how data needs to get stored or not stored. Our Gateway provides a way to manage that. It also allows clients to, to manage the cost associated with what data they pull in and the SLAs around how they pull it in, which is a critically important piece for technology groups. That means more agility. So big institutions want to add new data and change what data they use, add attributes on top of that data. One of the things that happens in a lot of institutions is application systems are pretty tightly coupled to the data sources, whether it's a credit bureau or some kind of uh, news search. And those data sources themselves are integrated into systems. So as a result, when people want to change what they use to serve customers better, that can be a big technology project. So a lot of institutions are looking to decouple those and create a layer in between so that they can go in and say, well, I want the data to be shaped in a slightly different way so I can serve a new segment in a new way or I can reduce fraud or I can manage things better. We also help with third-party data compliance. 
like cross-border data flows, like you're making sure data doesn't get stored when it's not allowed to get stored. We're a 50-person company and we work with leading financial institutions, banks and insurers primarily. For example, one of our clients originates small business loans online and all of the connectivity into the back-end data necessary for that, credit bureaus, news search, <coughs> verification sources, KYC, KYB, is done through our gateway. And we're able to get that product from a concept in a lab to a live production solution in partnership with the bank in four months. We have other clients that use us to streamline verification processes. We've processed 600 million transactions. We're operating in 15, 15 countries, primarily here and in Asia Pacific. We founded the business in Hong Kong. There's a lot of uh, markets in Asia that don't have the same data infrastructure. Markets like Indonesia, India and China that have emerging proliferation of data and financial institutions looking to innovate but the same architecture doesn't exist as to how that data gets accessed. So we're working a lot with clients in those countries as well. Our mission is to mobilize access to data so that our clients that are financial institutions can serve big new segments of customers so that they can originate online, so that they can show the right product to the right customer. And we're excited as data janitors that if we can help people get to the clean data, then the rocket scientists inside our clients can do wonderful things with that data. Getting to that clean, compliant, structured brick of data is really the hard problem in this marketplace. And we're solving for that for some of the largest institutions in the world. We thank the FinTech Innovation Lab for their time and we thank all of you. We hope you're going to be part of this revolution in mobilizing access to data.